it is steady for the markets, but there is one particular stock which has really perplexed investors in terms of the kind of returns we've seen. RVNL is the one that I'm talking about. To put things into perspective, it's not just gained only 71% or this year. But if you look at it, it listed in April of 2019 and its issue price as well as listing price was 19 rupees. It hit the markets with its IPO with a price band of between 17 to 19 rupees. And just look at where that stock is today. So you've seen a multi-bagger return come through for RVNL and it continues to surge in trade. Today, it's in focus after a big order win, also because it received Navratna's status last week. Vivek is here with the details on all that and more, which is driving RVNL. Well, absolutely. You know, so RVNL has been the stock in focus for the past uh, few trading weeks. In fact, especially given the strong up move the stock has seen in the last couple of trading sessions. So first, let's have a look at the news flow itself that's come in. So, you know, it's an other uh, prestigious order win that the company has got. So RVNL in a JV along with SEC has emerged as the lowest bidder. And this is for an EPC project that is worth almost 2,250 crore. Now, the RVNL share in the JV is at around 51%. Now, along with that, you know, recently there has been some positive news flow that's come in. So, the Department of Public Enterprises has gone ahead and upgraded RVNL status to a Navratna CPSE, that's a Navratna Central Public uh, Sector Enterprise. Now, what does this mean? You know, once you uh, become a Navratna, you actually have increased ease of operations and increased independence of operations as far as CAPEX, as, as so as far as investing into newer projects is concerned. So now the company can go ahead and invest up to 1,000 crore independently without the central government approval. And the company also can go ahead and form JVs and enter into partnerships abroad as well. So that gives it increased scope as far as revenue visibility is concerned. Now, when you're talking about RVNL itself, you know, one of the biggest triggers has been the kind of capex that the railway has, uh, railway ministry has seen. And the company emerging as the lowest bidder, uh, you know, for the recent one day train ordering also has acted as a key catalyst as far as the stock price is concerned. What does the company do? The company is an infrastructure project execution company, largely, you know, an EPC company, and which is why, you know, given the strong ordering activity that you've seen, the stock has seen a complete re-rating. As you mentioned, you know, just talking about the stock move, stock up 250% in the last year. That is, the stock has gone up three and a half times just in the last one year. Okay, thanks a lot for that. That's RVNL stock at a lifetime high. But IOL chemicals and RT drugs are also trading.